you alright guys, how's it going? Welcome back to Gaming and Console Tech. Now, I'm just gonna do basically a quick video on something which this I've been looking into. Um, as you guys have probably known for a while, I've downgraded on my collection a lot um, to the point where I'm basically using consoles for backwards compatibility. So I've got a PS2, which is also on my PS1. Um, my Wii, which is also my GameCube, um, basically things like that. And unfortunately, basically, I've not really got the room to put any like retro consoles. Um, I've been wanting room for to put in retro consoles, but it's kind of getting a bit tough and a bit jumpy at the moment. Um, so I've been looking into basically a couple of machines which will allow me to play retro games through one console, basically. Um, and I've come across a few, um, mainly ones that are dedicated to like Nintendo and Sega. So they play Master System games and Mega Drive games, for instance. Um, same with the Nintendo side of things. They play NES and SNES, which are a bit of a pain in the ass because obviously I want something that's going to play more than that. But while doing so, these. A machine as of late that has come out um, and basically it's a console that plays a lot of games from a lot of different console uh, a lot of different retro consoles and this is what I'm gonna look into and invest in hopefully um, now of course the machine I'm talking about is the Retron 5 uh, made by Hyperkin and they've made basically machines before which have been retro compatible basically um, now, sorry about my eye, I've been looking into buying this machine quite a bit lately and to be fair I've not really come up with a reason why yet until I looked at what games it actually plays. Now this is where it gets really good. Now I'm going to go through what the Retro 5, uh, sorry Retro 5, Retron 5 um, Hyperkin Retro 5 plays. Now, you'd be looking at basically Famicom, Super Nintendo, Original Nintendo, Super Famicom, <laughs> Sega Mega Drive, Game Boy games, Game Boy Color games, and also GBA games. All through the same console. And basically, what this means is that I can actually play, obviously, a Game Boy collection on my bigger TV. Now, the other thing with this is the fact that it's actually compatible with the Mega Drive Powerbase converter which converts basically the internal system of the Mega Drive to play Master System games. It's also compatible with that. So I might actually invest in getting a Master System converter as well which is always awesome. But basically what I want is your guys kind of input on this because obviously it's one of them which is really had some good and bad reviews. Um, if any of you guys have got one, or any of you guys that have actually come across one and played one, tell me what the what the deal is. Um, if you're happy with it, obviously it's not going to be perfect, but it does its job. But at the end of the day, I just wanted to tell you what my plans are for the future, where retro gaming is concerned, and hopefully get a lot of different input off you guys. But anyway, thanks for watching guys, and it's been a really short video this time, but end it did, that's life. Um, in the meantime guys, happy gaming, and I will see you in another video. It's Gaming and Console Tech, see you in a bit.